Something that the spiritual community don't tell you is that your emotions are not your friend and they should not be your guidance system. So your emotions, energy in motion, emotions, yeah, they are your ego, your energy go, ego, okay? So your emotions lie to you. You can have a situation, for example, where like um, you've got a partner and you see that they're talking to someone who's like pretty or whatever and then you start thinking, oh no, this person's going to like steal my boyfriend off me, he's going to run away. So you start getting jealous or whatever it is. So your emotions are telling you that there's a threat and you start getting jealous. In reality, are they actually a threat like or are you just overthinking it? Your emotions, let's say that the person ends up being becoming your best friend and helping you with something in life and didn't come anywhere near your boyfriend eventually and like you just was completely overthinking it all so your emotions were lying to you in that moment what they did show you though and it's a temporary solution they did show you what you need to work on which is your traumas your triggers like what you fear you need to like learn to overcome and let go of all of that so yes at start they showed you that you need to work on yourself but once you've done that healing once you've worked on yourself those emotions that fake fear doesn't exist anymore it's not real it never was real it lied to you so what should be your actual guidance system is intuition if you use your intuition and weren't clouded by your emotions you would have known from your soul that this person this woman is coming to help you in some way she'll be a benefit to your life she's going to be a good friend and all that and you would have sensed that in their energy and you would have felt that so your emotions lie to you they trick you yes they show you what you need to work on but only because you've got the shadow there if the shadow wasn't there your emotions won't be there and you'd have your intuition and your higher mind and you come from love unconditional love rather than attachment so your emotions are not your friends eventually you will learn to overcome them but yeah they, they teach you at first what you need to work on um to help you get rid of your shadow but once your shadow is gone so will your emotions be and then you can live from a higher mind from higher love unconditional love um, and yeah like live life in a much more blissful state